Hi, I'm Alicia Dorrit, your Rams TV host, sponsored by Desjardins Securities. Welcome to week one of your 2013 Rams season. Following our come-from-behind victory versus the U of M Bisons in our non-conference game this past weekend, we are gearing up for our season opener at the U of S Huskies. We're speaking to starting quarterback Cayman Shutter and defensive end Logan Brooks, as well as another edition of Frankly Speaking with Frank McChrystal, and our first edition of Strapping on the Horns with Alicia Dorrit, featuring kickers slash punters Zach Schmidt and Taylor Wandler. Hi, I'm here with Frank McChrystal, head coach of the Regina Rams. Uh, so we're just after the U of M Bisons non-conference game. Tell me how you felt about it. Uh, we felt pretty good. I mean, you know, Manitoba is always a physical team, big size, and, and certainly uh, for the most part experienced. They had a number of ex-junior players on the team. So I thought our guys did really well, you know, a, a younger group of guys that we had, and, and certainly as a first year, as a first test for the year, uh, playing a physical team like that's important. Awesome. And so now you've made your final cuts. Are there any surprises? Well, you know, really our cuts are made back in the spring. And, you know, I, I don't like to say cuts. I say we select the team back in the spring. So everybody that really showed up here uh, in the fall was by invitation, and that was our team. So, um, you know, we, we, didn't, we didn't have to release anybody or, or those types of things. Sometimes what happens is guys you know, decide and choose not to come back for any number of reasons from work to school to, you know, personal circumstances. But for the most part, you know, the team that we had in the spring is the team that we had in August. Great. And uh, so Cayman Shutter, he's our starting, starting quarterback? Cayman will start for us. Yeah, I mean, the, the three quarterbacks they, uh, that we have, they all did really well. Um, you know, uh, Cayman we felt pretty good about. He went 8 for 12. Uh, our little guy Noah did 12 for 12. He, he did very well too and, and we were impressed with that. Our plan though was to, to go with uh, uh, Cayman and John, you know, and have those two battle out for the starting position. And, and right now we feel that, that Cayman is a little bit ahead of John. Um, for any you know any number of reasons and certainly understanding of the game and I think what John needs to do is have a little experience playing and, and to relax a little more and I think once he gets relaxed I think that he'll perform better for us. Great and give us a little preview to the game away against U of S this Friday. Well it's always fun you know it's always kind of exciting up there they've got a you know a smaller venue than what we play in and so when they put people in there and certainly we are, we're a uh, pretty big draw for virtually all the teams that we play against uh, uh, and this one in particular so uh, there, there'll be a, a good number of fans there uh, in a small venue and uh, they've got the, uh, their sparklers and stuff going which is always kind of fun so uh, yeah we're really looking forward to it and, and uh, you know expect it to be a great game. Great thanks for speaking to us and good luck this Friday. Okay. This was uh, Frank McChrystal, head coach of the Regina Rams, and you were watching Frankly Speaking. Hi, I'm here with Logan Brooks, defensive end for your Regina Rams. Congratulations on the big win. How did the defense feel? Thanks, it felt good. We got a lot of new guys in there, so just get to all get out there and get a feel for everything. Yeah. Great, and what are you doing this week to prepare for your big rival against the Huskies? Um, basically, just trying to get all the plays and uh, kinks worked out of the system from last game, make sure we're executing everything right. And uh, yeah, just keeping the intensity high because it's going to be a big game. Saskatoon is one of our biggest rivals. Great. Well, they're probably pretty bitter about you uh, beating them last year in the in the playoffs. So how do you go about into that game? Uh, well, we got to be physical. We got to know all our assignments, and we just got to execute. Execution is the biggest key. So. Perfect. Well, thank you so much for speaking up to us, and good luck this week. Yeah, no Hi, I'm here with Cayman Shutter, starting quarterback of your Regina Rams. Welcome to Regina. I guess welcome back. You were born here, right? Yeah, I was born here. Awesome. And so this was your first game in this caliber at CIS in Canada. How did you feel about that game? Felt good. I mean, it was the first time playing with 12 men on the field and, well, 24, and having the wide field and having a bunch of guys come together. So, you know, ha having all that and, you know, getting the outcome that we had, it was, I was impressed. and. Um, I think it's a good thing to build on going forward. 
Great. And what are you doing this week to prepare for the big rival? Do you know about the big rival with the U of S? Yeah, I mean, I've heard a lot of hearsay. Um, I don't know if I'll really know about it until I experience it, but, uh, you know, our preparation is definitely ratcheted up and um, we're doing a lot of extra stuff um, film-wise because we don't have to uh, go to school yet. So, yeah, we have a lot of time to prepare and, and we're taking advantage of it and, and we're expecting it to be pretty intense. Great. And what can you bring to the Regina Rams as, as a rookie, I guess? Um, I, uh, I don't know. I'm, I'm just trying to, you know, fit in with the good group of guys that we have here. Um, you know, Coach Frank says we have a lot of uh, individual um, talents that we bring, each one of us, and we're trying to get everybody to complement the team by not being the same, but by building with uh, our talents individually to, uh, to make a better whole. Great. And so how are you fitting in with the team so far? I, I love it. I think we have um, a great group of guys that uh, care about each other and that um, want to see this team exceed every expectation. Great. Well, thank you so much and good luck in the home opener this week or the season opener this week. <laughs>